important for contractors' cash flow. The contractor relies on regular and fairly assessed payments to conduct his business. Underpayment or in the worst situation, non-payment will cause excessive strain on contractors' capital and ability to pay his debts. Contractors are required to maintain their cash flow as they need to pay for the plant, site operative, site staff, general overhead, nominated suppliers, suppliers, and nominated subcontractor. As per stated in Clause 69.0 in PWD 203A, the advance payment process which includes the contractor's entitlement on advance payment, the procedure of certification, accompanying documents, and recruitment. There is no provision for advance payment in PEM Contract 2018. Move on to the definition of advance payment which can be defined as the first payment to be made by employer to the contractor. Advance payments is eligible to be received by main contractors and nominated subcontractor. It is applicable to be used in conventional contract, design and build contract and turnkey contract. Advance payment can be applied within 3 months from the date of possession of site. There are three types of contract that can be applied for advance payment which are work contract, supply contract and service contract. For the work contract, the amount of advance payment eligible to be received by the main contractor according to PWD Form 203A is 25% of the value of builder's work subject to a maximum of 10 million ringgit Malaysia. While for the nominated subcontractor is 20% of the value of package subject to a maximum of 5 million ringgit Malaysia. For the supply contract, 25% of contract sum subject to a maximum of 10 million ringgit Malaysia as per stated in PWD Form 203A. The content of work contract and supply contract for Surat Pekeliling Perbendaharaan are same as PWD Form 203A. While for the service contract, about 15% of contract sum is subject to a maximum of 10 million ringgit Malaysia according to PWD Form 203A. And for Surat Pekeliling Perbendaharaan is about 15% of contract sum subject to a maximum of 5 million ringgit Malaysia. Here are the examples for calculation for advance payment. The contract sum will be less by provisional sum, prime cost sum and contingencies to get the total contract value of builder's work. Then, the total contract value of builder's work will be multiplied by the percentage given in the contract to get the amount of advance payment. Advance payment can help contractor in financing as the amount is not subject to retention and nominated subcontractor is also entitled to apply it. In order to get the advance payment, contractor shall submit the performance bond, guarantee for advance payment, insurance policies and so and sign letter of acceptance. Then, all the documents that submitted by the contractor will get certification by superintendent officer and the payment will be made by the employer. The advance payment is recoverable by deduction in interim payment certificates. The deduction in interim payment certificate starts with the value of builder's work executed, including materials on site, reach 25% of the total contract value of builder's work, while for the deduction in interim payment certificate stock with the value of builder's work executed, including materials on site, reach 75% of the total contract value of builder's work where the amount of advance payment has been repaid in full. The whole balance of the advance payment outstanding will immediately become due and payable to the employer which to be recovered from the bank guarantee if it cannot be recovered within the contract period of before the date of determination. 
the amount of deduction in each interim payment is calculated as follows RMD equals to 200 times by RMA over RMB percent of RMP where RMD is cumulative deduction to be made in interim certificate. RMA is total amount of advance pay. RMB is total contract value of builder's work while RMP is gross certified value of builder's work execute which including the amount certified for materials on site in excess of 25% of RMB. Here are another example for calculation for recruitment of advance payment. By using the same formula on recruitment which RMB equals to 200 times by RMA over RMB percent of RMP. The deduction to be made for recruitment of advance payment in interim payment number 06 is 725,830 ringgit and 61 cent ringgit Malaysia.